I will uh, start by reviewing uh, the assignment that you are supposed to finish it in so inshallah as soon as uh, possible uh, before uh, 17. Uh, 17th of May, the deadline it is 15th of uh, May. Uh, I try your best to uh, finish before the deadline, it's uh, much better. And every student will submit uh, the assignment itself uh, to his or her doctor. Yani, uh, only my students can uh, submit to the link, to my link. Okay, on Yani, please, if, if you are with Dr. Muhammad Abbas, submit to Dr. Muhammad Abbas. If, if you are with Dr. Shahinda, please submit to Dr. Shahinda. Type. Hello, what we are going to do, yeah, uh, guys, we are going to um, start reviewing uh, the assignment. I want you to take notes. Let know. You know, I have many students who are still repeating the same questions because they, they don't know what's going on. Okay, uh, thank you for all the students who are being cooperative and trying to help uh, their friends. And to our field, assignments should be done individually because uh, you are going, uh, we are going to uh, submit the assignments on expose or submit the assignments or make sure that there is no plagiarism because once I see a copy paste or similar answers based on my correction, students, they will. Uh, we will deduct uh, grades and you will not be happy. Can you hear me? Okay. So uh, only Allah Imkin, Allah check Habibte. Check ya Allah. Taib Allah, what we're going to do is that once you download the assignments you have take notes guys if you uh, if you if you if you need so because it's really good to take notes so you avoid confusion after uh, this uh, tma is going to be out of 40 and not out of 20 anymore i'm going to we are going to uh, uh, we are going to what uh, we are going to uh, modify the, the grades distribution based on the uh, new uh, marking schedule. So this is going to be out of 40, guys. Once you enter this, you have to fill uh, in the, here the day, date, the branch, name, section number, tutor's name, and ID. It's very important to write, to fill in all these important uh, information. Uh, uh, and then you make sure that you do this individually because you are going to be uh, uh, you are going to be reported if we find out that you are copying and pasting, especially that the uh, assignment is super easy, guys. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure that you can do it, and it's super easy. You have Google that can help you a lot. So. So no need at all to copy and paste from your uh, friends. Question one is divided into two parts, as we explained earlier. This question is based on an article on page. Nada and I prefer to uh, all you uh, to, to submit before the 15, because at the end of the month, you are going to have another assignment. In April, you are going to have another assignment in April at the end of this month. We still don't know anything about it yet. Okay, we, we start, we see, for this assignment, it is 15th of May, 15th of May. I'm telling you, try to submit before 17th of May, 15th of May, Anna, I feel that it's the best day for the last day of submission to avoid uh, any confusions, okay? So don't leave yourself until the end. Mm. This assignment, uh, we still have a lot of time for this assignment, guys. We still have one month, right? Because as you can see up, this assignment 
is due 17th of May. So Anna, I'm telling you to finish before 17th. Okay, so you still have a lot of time. But Anna, I advise you to start. Why? Because you are going to have uh, another assignment coming at the end of the uh, at the end of April, I think. At the end of April, I'm not sure yet. But in order not to pressurize yourself, اشتغلوا شوي شوي يعني work شوي شوي يا جماعة. Work شوي شوي. Okay, so we you will be having short TMA, a short TMA assignment, maybe at the end of April. I'm not sure. I am not sure when exactly, so don't spread words and start asking. But you are going to have another short TMA. Uh, we, uh, we will announce it soon. And this one. كثير منيح. محمد علي انت كمان معي هون ولا انت حاضر محمد علي تاني؟ اوكي. So uh, what you are going to do is <laughs> okay. So what we are going to do is that work on your assignments شوي شوي you have a lot of time but you're going to have another uh, assignment so you never know when they when they will announce that so you will be ready. You don't pressurize yourself or squeeze yourself. Now, this assignment, uh, question one, part one, is based on the page 147 in your reading books. It's based, based on uh, 147 in your reading book, theme five. What you're going to do, you're going to edit and you're going to rewrite. Edit means the right words. The red words, you are going to choose the right word, only one word, okay? And you are going to rewrite the article. The article is made up of four paragraphs, I, as I remember, and you have to rewrite it again. And into Shop Town, you remove these, you remove them, you start copying and pasting, rewriting, sorry, no copy and paste, rewriting. It's like copying and pasting paragraph one. Paragraph two, paragraph three, paragraph four. And you don't forget to insert the commas and the punctuation with capitalization. Lando, it's very important that you don't skip this, this task uh, without, you don't do this task without punctuation. full stops. Or don't forget that the words in red, you have to choose only one of them. You choose one of them. You choose... كيف يعني handwritten? كيف يعني handwritten? How if you if you write it in your hands? Why you have to write it in your hands? You don't understand. If you are going to submit it on LMS, yeah, Farah. You want to scan it, يعني what is the issue, يعني? No, I don't understand you. Why you want to do it handwriting? You are going to do to to submit it back to me. If you want to submit it back, uh. To me, this means that it ha ta ta only you have to use the same document, Farah. This one, uh, uh, how you don't know? It is written the information here in front of your eyes. Here, you can see that. Here, okay? So you have to fill this. What you're going to do, best when you want to answer, you remove the lines and you start answering, Farah. That's it. And you save it and you upload it. Why you have to do it on something else on a on a piece of paper? You know, it's much easier for you to directly uh, submit your answer here. When you go for the article on page one forty seven, you are going to choose one. Habibti uh, 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 You are going to choose one of the words. Until you have two words in brackets. You remember that? You remember that you have two words in brackets on page one forty seven in the article. Did you see the article on page 147? Okay. Okay, and Zainab, I remember that you saw that. So on that uh, page, on what page 147, you are going to choose one of the words that is uh, appropriate, uh, uh, proper page, okay, the proper word, sorry, and you are going to uh, copy the four paragraphs here. You remove these lines and you copy, you rewrite, uh, type, yeah, type. You are going to type here, 
the four uh, paragraphs as they uh, are. Don't forget to choose the right answer of the, ra the, the red words. I explained that uh, the, this assignment last time. Based on the insights you get from the article on your own research, give complete answers to the following questions. I told you once you read the article, you will be able to answer questions A, B, C, and uh, D. Okay, also show Alcon and do your own research. Yani into Fikon when you want to answer to refer to the article on page 147. I'm Nisma. Nafsal article on page 147. We refer to it to the article on page 147 and we answer the questions. And or we can do our own research, Google, to answer the questions. Who was with me last time when I explained this? If you were with me last time, if you did attend the lecture, tell me, how am I going to answer? Who remembers? I need a volunteer to answer, please. I want you to tell me how you're supposed, in my opinion, a full answer. What do I mean by the full answer, EMS? Take the first one as an example. Is information on the internet usually wrong? What I have to do? What shall I say? Shriyani, it depends. Okay. We have to write a full answer, Ya Hassan, Madam. Full answer, yani we get it from the question. Is information on the internet usually wrong? What shall I say? I say the information, the information, um, uh, it's no, not about right words. It has to be not more than two uh, sentences. The information on the internet, like two, two lines, the information on the internet is usually wrong because you have to answer from the question or the information uh, on the internet is not usually wrong because you have to write and justify your answer. Justification, I have one mark, more than one mark, will structure half a mark, will content half a mark. So you have to understand how you are going to answer. Is information on the internet usually wrong? Either yes or no. If you say yes, you are going to say yes, the information on the internet is usually wrong because, or no, the information on the internet is not usually wrong because. From where I get the justification and reason, from the article on page 147 or from Google. Clear? Okay, now, are writers on the internet always biased? What shall I say? Writers on the internet are always biased because, or writers on the internet are not always biased because. Biased, yani min has, min hazin. Yani most, I explained that last time. Lama yamlu alam abhath, lama yiji yamlu research, بيروحوا لفئة معينة في كثير مثلا باحثين مثلا بيقولوا مثلا انه البويز they are smarter than girls let's say عم يعملوا بحث عن يشوفوا من اذكى البنات ولا الصبيان بيقوموا بيقولوا الصبيان اذكى وما بيتبعوا الاجراءات يعني ما بيشوفوا السرفي مثل ما كانت شو بيعملوا بينحازوا لانه هن مع الصبيان اكثر بينحازوا هل بتعتبروا في do you think in the writers on the internet, the writers the writers, sometimes la fikra, la shay muayan. And do you have to find the answer from page 147 or from uh, research? Research means when you uh, browse information, it can be the information from internet website, web pages, articles, uh, books, chapter of books, it can be from anywhere. You have to write, writers are biased 
on the internet because or writers are not biased because biased because any question full answer it's important yeah 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 zahra okay is it easy to detect bias in tika uh, okay. They are always biased on the internet because eh. Type is it easy to detect bias? Shimon all ma into la matulu is who are home and some on yes or no questions. I so uh, that start with is or are. Should are you Ahmad? Yes, I am Ahmad. Is this your brother? Yes, he is my brother. Miss Amun yes or no questions, yes, I is it easy to detect bias? So what shall I answer here? Yes, it is easy to detect bias because, or no, it's not easy to detect bias because. So, uh, how about if you're asking about the question I'm explaining now or you're jumping to something else? Which is say? Yeah, guys, يعني معقول بتقطعوني لا تسألوني أسئلة ما خاصة بالشيء بالشيء الشرح اللي عم بشرحه. Please, بس نخلص تسألوا اللي بتكوني. I will give you the chance to answer, guys. Don't interrupt me when I'm explaining. لأنه you will you will get confused. Please. Okay. Yeah. Do you need to check many sources before you come up with an assessment of an issue? Do we usually go for many resources before we uh, complete any assessment? And I usually, as a teacher, if I want to prepare for my students, شو اللي لازم تحلوه اليوم يا جماعة؟ بليز حدا يجاوب علاء علاء انت كنتي معي قبل حبيبتي شو اللي لازم تحلي اليوم يا عمري؟ You don't read يا علاء Not only علاء علاء look here حبيبتي Did you read this? Here here did you read here? You know how many times I talked about this on the WhatsApp and this lecture and the lecture before. Guys, when you're going to start be يعني هيك, uh, to, to read, يعني, it's very important to read. Reading is really important. Because if you don't read, we will not let, يعني, be able to understand anything. So regardless of the fact that I'm giving you this lecture, you have to learn to read, okay? So when you read the information, uh, 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 you will be able to answer. Farah, give me your number. Zahra, I think, the one who is having it. Zahra, you are the admin. Who is the admin? Have you been, please send her number to the admin. One one two guys, send uh, the lady's number to the admin so they can add her, please. Okay. Send Farah's number to the admin so they can add her. لحظة شوي زهرة is the admin I'm not sure زهرة are you with me اوكي مروة يعطيك العافية حبيبتي يلا let us continue اوكي okay? يلا يا guys Do you need to check uh, uh, 
Bravo, Mohammed. I don't need to check uh, many sources before I come up with an assessment because I was telling you, you know, Anna, before I come, uh, before I, um, I teach, what do I do? I have to research and I have to check many sources to find the best thing for you. You understand what I mean? This is what I'm giving you example. I need to check many sources before I come up with an assistant. Sometimes I provide you, I may, I might have, uh, or uh, I may get some information or some assessments or something that is, يعني, and I know my students are not able to do it. That's why I check more than one source to make sure you know, my students are happy with what I'm giving them. أنا اللي بدي إياكم تعرفوا دايما بس بكون تجاوبوا بحياتنا in general we give full answers okay we give full answers لأنه uh, حتى أنتوا in your jobs when you want to answer an email بتحطوا subject the subject it should be clear or you start by introducing the topic so introducing the topic is very um, uh, important and then you specify نحن we, we study language and I told this to your friends before, uh, it it's, it's not just because now you are having an assignment and you want to do it and you want to get marks. But I had she, what we're doing now, it helps us a lot in our jobs, in our communication in general, and the language is a means of communication. Fashionic, it's highly important to learn and improve our English skills. Hello, who remember the thesis statement here. Recently, there have been reports on the media about the dangers of mobile phones. On the media, social media, Facebook, Instagram, or in, 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 uh, in newspapers, <laughs> magazine, they were talking about the dangers of mobile phones. mobile phones. How truthful and honest are these reports? You are going to research about the topic and you have to write an essay. Uh, 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 with or uh, for or against. For or what? Against. If I want, if I am for, يعني I am with, يعني I agree. If I am against, يعني I don't agree. Sometimes we agree and don't agree at the same time. Okay. شو بدنا نعمل هلا؟ مين بيقول لي؟ What uh, would a thesis statement look like? Who can tell me? يلا, I want a volunteer to tell me what would a thesis statement look like, يا شباب. Okay? If I am saying there have been reports on media about dangers of mobile phones, how truthful and honest are these reports. You are against or with what the reports say. So what can we answer? What is the thesis statement that I have to put at the end of the introduction? Who can tell me? Uh, uh, you are going to write the advantages and disadvantages, but not in this way. And you have to write thesis statement that shows something related to the topic. The topic, it says, how truthful and honest are these reports? These reports, they say they are talking about the dangers of mobile phones. Do you agree with what they say? Are you against or with what, uh, through what the reports say? So what is the thesis statement? Okay, Muhammad Ali. I agree. We have to pick a side. I agree what? I agree what? I agree that these reports are truthful about what they say in regards of dangers of the mobile phones. Or I agree with these reports uh, um, that mobile phones are 
dangerous for many reasons. If you agree with these reports that mobile phones are dangerous, you are going to write short body paragraphs, two body paragraphs short, talking about the negative effects of the mobile phones or the dangers of mobile phones. You get my point? And don't forget that you have uh, to do uh, what I taught you before. Lehu will reference. Lehu will you say the name of the author? Who put Ulo 2000 whatever? Alex 2014. Alex put Hotua Barra Heg. Shubna Mel 2014. Stated that. ومن كمل أو بتكتبوا الباراجراف تكتبوها and at the end of the paragraph شو بتعملوا تحطوا Alex 2014 مين Alex Alex مطرح ما عم جيب الانفورميشن من عنده you are going to write the information you get it from Alex in your own words بتحطوا you write اسم Alex مع date at the end of the paragraph Oh, you start like this. Alex 2014 stated that the mobile phones, blah, blah, blah. Here in your introduction. Well, at the end of the introduction, Shumun Hot at the end of the introduction thesis statement. Whether you agree or you don't agree, Ma'amin, statement, Katabneha, Agalat. Whether you agree or you don't agree with what? With the reports. If you agree with the reports, This means you are going to talk about the dangers of mobile phones, about the dangers of mobile phones. Each body paragraph should start with the topic sentence. Kill paragraph with the topic sentence that tells about the dangers of mobile Phones. Right or not right? Okay. Mean is the kill, but do you have any topic sentence? Uh, first body paragraph, topic sentence about the dangers of mobile phones. نحن عارفين إنه كل body paragraph لازم يكون فيها topic sentence. It tells what's the paragraph about. صحيح هذا الحكي أو لا? Guys, are you with me? Okay. غير محمد علي شباب وصبايا عطوني topic sentence it tells what's the body paragraph about which is about the dangers of mobile phones. Shoo, guys. What are the dangers of mobile phones? You don't know how to start? Give me only one, uh, only one. One topic sentence. Mahda Biarif. Okay, Amal. Uh, mobile phones. Uh, are hard. Uh, طيب. Mobile phones are harm harmful to health. ولا بدنا نحدد شوي. هيدي كتير جنرال يا uh, شو اسمه. هيدي كتير جنرال يا أمال. لأنه هني أصلاً mobile phones. تيك تقولي are health uh, causes. مثلاً they cause. Uh, uh, شو اسمه مثلاً. Um, health problems if you could only they cause uh, like uh, for example like uh, brain tumor and uh, brain tumor and ما بعرف شو فيك تسمي فيك تسمي شو هن health problems وبتاني paragraph شو تقولي mobile phones ها, uh, uh, causes the people or uh, uh, have شو اسمه causes people to become uh, uh, introspective or aggressive لانه بدلهم على الموبايل فونز وبتشرحي كيف they become addicted okay 
فروم از دينجرس هاي لي بالشرح زينب هاي لي الراديشن فيرست هاي لي بالشرح الباراجراف الاولى بس انا عم بحكي كتوبيك سنتنس بتقول موبايل فونز كان كوز هيلث بروبلمز لايك برين تيومر اند مثلا كذا كذا وبتحكي كيف ثاني بادي باراجراف بتقول موبايل فونز have negative effect on the on the people's social side لأن the people بيصيروا منعزلين و introspective صار عندك two body paragraph واحدة بتحكي فيها عن الحالة الاجتماعية واحدة بتحكي فيها عن الأمراض so أنا اللي بدي لكم هي it's highly important that you start your body paragraph with a, a topic sentence from where you will get the information from at least two research uh, articles يعني two research Papers. Don't forget to do the reference, as I told you. Once you write the paragraph, بتخلو الreference تحت تحت بآخر ال paragraph عشان ما تنسو. مثل ما علمت كنت يتعملو على ال word document. You remember? You remember the word document, guys? Okay, guys. Let's show you. Teacher, this is. Um, into bil into Ahsan, you are talking about the introduction, right? In your introduction, you know, Hussain, how you can start? You can start with a question, you, but you have to do research. عرفت حسين لازم تعمل بحث, okay? وتجيب المعلومات من البحث وتكتبها بطريقتك. Uh, بس نحن عادة حسين شو بنعمل? We write in, um, أكيد مش copy paste, you write in your own words مثل ما فهمت. Well, general introduction بدها تكون على الموبايل, phones. General introduction عن موضوعنا اللي هو mobile phones وعلى فكرة ال techniques that we use to write a paragraph أنت حر تكتب بالطريقة اللي بدك إياها فيك تبلش لي يعني you you go research وتأخذ المعلومات you do it in your nice way you can start with a question you can start with a quotation مثل أو مثل an apple away keeps the doctor an apple a day keeps the doctor away okay uh, use the e-library if you wish. Anna, and to do it the way you wish, guys. Anna, behemni, shuf is same, rattabe, u helwe, u mitl masharacht. Anna, I will feel very happy to see that my students are learning from me. If you want to use the e-library, and to use two references, bas, two references, two references, mitl ma'allam tkun yohun, two references. Okay, did you see what I did? Baatilkon sharah al al one one two. Did you see that? Uh, did you see the document? Did you see how to? I send on the group on the one one two group how uh, we can do citation. Did you see that? Sahel sah. It's very easy, right? It's very easy, yeah, Jamia. It is very easy, okay? So once you get the information, you 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 do the citation at the same time. You copy and paste the cite reference. You put it at the end of the You write it at the end of the essay. At the end of the essay. يعني هم تحت. بس تخلصوا قبل ال good luck. قبل ال good luck. You put the citation in the references here. Okay, at the end. Okay, finish from this. Don't forget that you have to write five pa pa body paragraphs. Uh, uh, sorry, introduction, thesis statement at the end of the introduction, body paragraph one, body paragraph two, or one big body paragraph, and concluding paragraph, and concluding paragraph. Okay, four. يعني أنتو you are not supposed to write less than one fifty words before you submit. شوفوا العدد الكلمات هون يا جماعة. ماشي يا صبايا وشباب. Did you understand? 
Shall we finish from this? Because we are talking a lot about it. Okay, clear. I would like to thank all the students who are attending the lectures. Leno and I can see from the conversation who are the students who are following and who are not, who are working hard. Honestly, Anjad, Anjad, thank you for all students. Uh, Marwa Khalid, uh, Zainab, uh, Muhammad Ali, Hussain, I don't know if you were or not. Thank you so much for your hard work. Sadduni, uh, you will, uh, every student will pay the credit of his hard work. Okay, hard work. Yani, so don't be relaxed. That's very good that what you're doing.
Hello. Hello, I'm sorry for that. <coughs> okay, guys, are you following? Just excuse me because I have uh, small kids, so you know I'm, te I'm, I'm teaching from home. So just be patient with me, guys. Uh, okay. Did you understand, guys, what we have to do? Any questions on the essay? Do you have any questions here? Everything is clear. Time. Shall I move to something else? Yeah. Now, we are going to start with a theme five, Ya Marwa. It is about customs and origins and effects. Uh, when we uh, start a new themes, Anna, I usually uh, ask students to refer to the book and to review all the vocabulary words. Uh, um, uh, to review all the vocabulary words, uh, vocabulary words in the theme itself. Okay, so no need to waste time on the vocabulary. No, Anna, I know that you can read the vocabulary words. Our focus will will be using good uh, grammar skill using the conditional if and prepositions writing against to for essay. I always like to review essays with you guys. And Nahoni, we are going to learn how to use what how to use a uh, wood, how to use shoe wood. Take please this link with me and I'm going to start explanation the use of wood. I wanted to let you know that using wood is very important. Hala, wood, Wood is an auxiliary verb. Uh, we use wood in many situations. And to have the modal verbs will auxiliary verbs. Uh, modal verbs will uh, auxiliary uh, verbs. We uh, use them uh, like um, may or might or can or could or, uh, or uh, must or should or shall. كلهم هول شو منسميهم هول منسميهم modal verbs we we do we call we 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 name them or we call them modal verbs would is one of the important modal verbs that it's very uh, we are I I I I was telling the other group who joined me in the morning that it's very uh, it's very important to learn how to use would because and there are many situations that we need to use wood to show how professional and polite we are. That we use wood uh, to talk about the past. We use wood to talk about the future, but in the past. Hala bilkun kif yani about the future in the past. Okay, we use uh, wood to explain conditional mood. Conditional yani if, shartiye. طيب كيف بنستخدم wood يا جماعة على structure اللي هي subject plus verb plus wood plus main verb كيف يعني؟ يعني for example I would like tea she would not go يعني subject plus wood plus main verb البيز بنقول له البيز شو بنقول له البيز بنقول له شو البيز we call it the بيز طيب شو اسمه؟ بسم الله شو كنت عم اقول؟ uh, she would not go. Uh, would you help, please? This is the question form. طيب هلا نحن we are going to see the examples of using wood for the past. We often use wood as a kind of past tense, uh, uh, like كيف يعني. Even as a boy, he knew that he would succeed in life. I thought it would rain, so I brought my umbrella. يا جماعة الخير كيف يعني in the past؟ كيف يعني in the past؟ يعني for example أنا إجت تلميذ لعندي على الصف وما معه الكتب. شو بقول له؟ I thought you would bring your books. هو action صارت بالماضي. I thought you would uh, uh, bring so many uh, مثلا uh, materials. Because we need them in the classroom. Okay, so, uh, يعني اللي بدي لكم إياه لما أقول إنه نحن الود we use it 
to uh, refer to an action that happened in the past, this means that uh, it happened and finished the way you are expressing it in the past. Yani, I thought you would it would rain, so I brought my umbrella. Okay, she keeps me as a kind of past tense. She said that she would buy some eggs. Okay. She said, بيجي أنا بقول in the reported speech, أنا عم بحكي مع زهرة. شو عم إلا لزهرة? She said, Fatima said that she would buy some some eggs. She would buy some eggs. Okay, زهرة so thought that she would buy some eggs. هيدا أنا هي عم بحكي عن action in the past. زهرة قالت لفاطمة شيء وجيت أنا عم بنقل الحكي لأحمد عم قل له إنه زهرة قالت لفاطمة هيك she said something to فاطمة in the past إنه هي كانت حابة to buy some eggs to buy some eggs طيب so the first use of food we use it in the past we use it in the past guys طيب for example the candidate said that he wouldn't increase taxes the candidate said that he wouldn't increase taxes. You know, I won't increase taxes. It is something that he said in the past, or mm, I'm reporting what he said. يعني مثلا أنا, uh, uh, my friend, she said something. بيجي أنا عند مين عند زهرة وبقلة, uh, My friend said that she would not buy uh, 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 her dress. She would buy. She would not buy the dress. Okay. So it is an action that's happening in the past type we often use would not to talk about uh, past refusals كيف يعني هلا هيدي انا ما بدي احكي عن الباست ريفيوزرز از كومبليكيتد فور يو تاي وي وي يوز وود فور ذا فيوتشر ان ذا باست كيف يعني ذا فيوتشر ان ذا باست ان لندن شي ميت ذا مان ذا شي وود شي وود وان داي ماري هي ان ذا فيوتشر هي شي از ثينكينج اباوت to marry this man in the future. But she's thinking in the past about something she would, will do in the future. Okay. He left five minutes late, unaware that the delay would save his life. Final example, it's a little bit difficult. But Anna, when I say about something in the future, um, I would like to meet Ahmed this Friday. Friday ma ija ya jamia. Friday ma ija. Okay, Friday Baduma Ija. But Shubul, I would like to meet uh, Ahmed this Friday, Maneta. I'm using wood to express an action in the future, in the coming future. Okay, so wood for a conditionals. We often use wood to express the so called second and third conditional. Kifiani, if he lost his job, he would have no money. دائما دائما مع الكونديشن الشرطية شو بنستخدم نستخدم مود نستخدم مود if I had won the lottery وهي something that uh, uh, يعني كيف نحن لما منقول أنا إذا ربحت اللوتو إذا ربحت اللوتو لح اشتري سيارة إذا ربحت اللوتو I would buy uh, the a car I would buy a car if I won the lottery Okay, so uh, what, what's going to happen is that we use wood, we use wood to express an action that is, uh, that will not uh, be true. يعني may not come to be true, يا جميع. كيف يعني may not become, uh, may not come be, may not come true. يعني كيف لما بعدنا عم إلكن. If I had won the lottery, I would have bought a car. كيف يعني لو ربحت ال الفلوس او المصاري او اليا نصيب واللوتو شو بيصير كنت حاشتري سياره you understand what i mean to express an action with the if conditional that it will it may not become true هلا انا شو بقول على طول شو بقول يا صبايا وشباب are you following على طول بقول شو بقول اذا صار معي 500 بيري لو صار معي 500 بي دي اي وود يعني باي ا نيو لابتوب اف اي هاد 500 بي دي اي وود باي ا نيو هو 
هو شيء ما ما صار اصلا هو ما صار عرفت له شو يعني ما صار ما انت ما معك لو معك 500 بي دي كانت كانت اشتريت اللابتوب سو وي يوز ات وذ ذا اف وذ ذا كونديشنال اف الشرطيه اف الشرطيه بنسميها ار يو فولوينج ار يو فولوينج جايز عم تفهموا على ايش عم بحكي اوكي هو اللي باي براكتس يعني اوكي هو اللي باي شو باي براكتس هلا with for desire يعني انتو if desire يعني رغبة I would love to live here I would love to travel to see my mom I would love to have coffee please مثل ما يسألونا would you like to have some coffee please دائما هيدي بالسؤال for polite request what do we answer نحنا I would like to I would like to travel I would really want to blah 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 so what does this mean I would This means that I have the desire and the rغبة. So we use it to have a desire. For polite request, معروفي. Would you please answer my question? وكمان الكود. وكمان الكود. Okay, بس ال الود هيك الكود كود يعني فيها قابلية عندك القدرة يعني لو سمحتي. بس الود هيك فيها كثير لطافة وفيها kindness. Would you please help me to complete my homework? Okay. Would you please help me to 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 uh, to grab this chair? So it is for polite request. For polite request. Hala would for opinion or hope. She any hope tamani. Okay. I would expect him to come. Okay. Uh, I would imagine they will buy a new one. Okay. For hope. For opinion or hope. For a wish. I wish you would stay more. Tijla andi masalan ala. تقعد عندي خمس دقايق آلاء she will sit only for five minutes شو بقلها لآلاء إذا بدي إياها تقعد أكتر I wish you would stay more I wish you would stay for dinner فهمتوا علي؟ فبصير أنا شو قلها لآلاء عشان تبقى عندي I wish you would stay هيدي يعني I want you to stay I really want you to stay عرفتي؟ أنا بحب كتير استخدامات ود لأنه فيها شو من إلا أتيكات فيها أتيكات وفيها ذو كتير بالتعاطي فيها ذو كتير بالتعاطي أوكي فكتير حلو تو يوز لا would you could مش نفس الشيء ال ال could بتستخدم لل possibilities you could either use this book or that book ال could بتستخدم لل polite request كمان مثل would would you like would you could you help me please تقدر تساعديني أوكي بتقدر يساعديني could would بتشارك وبس بهيدي الشغلة إنه بال بال ال polite request بس تينيتون فينا نستخدمه لل polite request بس أوكي لأنه الكود فيها قدرة أكتر فيها قدرة وبي إن ما بي إهني هون نستخدمه لل desire لل polite request if you have a hope wish for a wish I wish you could stay you you would stay more مش هندرس كلهم نحنا عم درسكن أنا بس الكل اللي منقدر نعملهم أوكي ماشي I want you to do this quiz guys To, to see what did you understand from what don't check the answer before you do it لو سمحتوا الله يرضى عليكم don't check the answers before you do it يلا توكلوا على الله
I just realized that the microphone was blocked by mistake. Okay, sorry, that's why I was answering. So uh, I knew he would be famous one day, right? He said that he uh, would to he wouldn't or he he would which is this one he would right so i knew he would be famous number three guys number three i asked him to walk faster but he what at first he wouldn't at first he wouldn't at first as children we what every day we play together every day nobody knew that one day he would no, one day he would be rich. تعرفوا شو معناتها هيدي nobody knew that he one day would be rich. هيدي uh, nobody knew هيدي in the past. هيدي صارت أيمتى بالpast. مثل ما أنا بقول إذا ما جت زينب على الصف بالكتاب شو بقول لها I thought you would bring your book. هيدي إنه أنا فكرت كنت لح تجيبي. If you ask me say you were crazy. If you ask me would I say you are crazy? ولا I would say. I would say you are crazy. Would you, Hedrick, had a for polite request? Would you like to go? Bravo, ya Zainab. Habib, Okay. Do you think he'd help? I am sure if you asked. I am sure, sure he would help if you asked, right? Shall Farid Ben Haydu Haydi, ya Mamir? Haydu Haydi. Haydi mumkin it's going he would. Or Haydi mumkin it's going he had. Right? Shul iqtisar la he had. What is the abbreviation of he had? Bitsir kif. Shul iqtisar la he had. Mara it ma'ana fu. He'd. Right? He'd. Okay? Middle he would. Right? Fantibu bayneton. Nahna men all he had played. أو شو فينا نقول he'd played فما تت ما تتلخبطوا أو أو he would شو بنقول he would شو بتصير he'd sorry he'd يعني he would you understand ف he had بتنكتب بال contraction بالاختصار like he like he would Okay, guys, fim to what am I talking about? So, to pull ahead is Charlie. He would, he had, then al benafsil tariya. Okay, he had, or he would, then al benafs tariya. Type. We want to play tennis. I wish. Nahna nistahdim would, ma wish. I would, I wish it would stop raining or it had raining or it will raining. It would stop raining. So, it is. Would it is would would stop raining? Okay, type. Hala, we are going to explain more about the if, the conditional if, ya sabayo shabab. Okay, any questions about would? Okay, it's by practice. I ask you please to refer to uh, the links I always send you. لأنه they are really important. They are really important. طيب, the conditional if. The conditional if, it's very important to use it in uh, our lives, by the way. كثير مهم conditional. خاصة أنا, for example, I use it a lot with my kids. If you finish your sandwich, okay, if you finish your sandwich, I will give you I would give you a lollipop, okay? So I always use the F with them in order to motivate لحتى شجعون وهيك. طيب, نحنا عنا شيء اسمه the first conditional, guys. The f not the first. I am going to start with the zero conditional, sorry. Zero conditional. Zero conditional, we use if plus present simple plus present simple. We have a sentence that could made up of two parts. The part that start with if or the other part or the other show part. Yani, if people eat too much, comma, they get fat. If people eat too much, comma, they get fat. Shu yani hum. And two, you look at the sentence. Is a sentence? Malafi in two parts. Will if the part that has the part uh, that starts with if, okay? But you can ben part 
وذس بارت ريليشن شيب يعني بده يكون في نتيجه سبب ونتيجه فاكت حقيقه فاكت حقيقه او نتيجه ريزلت كيف يعني؟ If people eat too much they get fat هيدي حقيقه ولا مش حقيقه؟ منطق ولا مش منطق؟ It is it is logical it makes sense it's fact so when do I use a simple present here with if and a simple present here with if لما يكون عندي سبب ونتيجة منطقيين. You understand what I mean? When I'm, I'm, I'm talking about something that I'm expecting شو uh, نتيجة. If water reaches 100 degrees, it boils. هاي ده حقيقة ولا مش حقيقة? If water reaches 200 degrees, it boils. This is a fact. This is a what يا شباب وصبايا. This is a fact. So when I'm using a fact in the if clause, The verb has to be uh, in the present, and the other verb has to be in the present. Okay, the first uh, verb has to be in the present, and the other verb has to be in the uh, present. This is when uh, when I do that when I'm using if we close the, where I have uh, two parts in the sentence. The first part is related to the other part, and uh, 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 the first part. If I write the first part, I'm expecting a result to happen, a result, natije. If water reaches 100 degrees, shun natije, it boils. So على ما عم بحكي بال... ب... بيكون في relationship between the two parts, two clauses in the sentence وفي result, I use verbs in the simple present tense. I use verbs in the simple present tense. Did you understand when I use the simple present tense with the if clause? Yes or no? خلاص؟ مفهمينين على الأكيد زينب؟ Okay, so ننتبه نحن when we are writing, when we are writing, if we are writing an if الشرطية وبمعنى بدنا نعبر عن relationship وفي result, we have to write the first verb in the present and the second verb in the simple present tense. You get my point? I want you to do this exercise. We are going to do it together, guys. We are going to do it together. Ready? I'm going to mention your names. Yalla ya shabab sabaya. Yalla ya shabab. Shu bool. If I what? Lazim ikun here present and here shu present. Okay? If I shu bool. If I yalla harku halkum maai lau samahtu lau samahtu. If I what? يلا فيقوا فيقوا يلا فيقوا wake up if I what do you want the link guys do you want the link يلا يلا حاضر يلا wait I want to give you yes no problem يا زينة حبيبت يلا يلا يا جايز نحن we have we're using the zero conditional if I wake up شو بنقول wake up right لأنه we have to use the simple present late what will happen when you wake up late guys there should be a نتيجة right or not right when when there is a نتيجة we are going to use both verbs in the simple present tense when I wake up late شو بيصير B يعني verb to be is و am و are. I am excellent. I am late for work. I am late for work. Right or not right? طبيعي. طيب if my husband cook, what will happen when the husband cook? شو النتيجة يا جماعة? He what? He burns the... Sorry, كتبنا burns one. He burns the food. Both verbs should be in the simple present tense. Right or not right? If it's Julia, not where. What do I use for the simple present tense مع not? Simple present tense مع not. شو بستخدم مع not للسimple present tense? Do not or does not. 
صح ولا لا شو بقول if Julia does not wear right does not wear she gets she gets right or not right right لأنه أنا مع not in the simple present we have to use both verbs in the simple present tense طيب if children not eat شو منقول if children what يلا يا شباب please follow up with me if children what do not eat excellent if children do not eat what will happen if children do not eat they what verb to be شو will verb to be they verb to be هن is و am و are they are not they aren't they are not that's amazing طيب if you mix شو بيصير يا جماعة electricity water and electricity you get a shock لاحظتوا ال relationship يا محمد عبد النبي between أول part of the sentence و تاني part of the sentence في سبب ونتيجة لما يكون في سبب ونتيجة and I'm using if I use the first verb in the present and the other, the other verb in the present okay the other verb in the simple present tense type هلا we are going to go for the first conditional guys شو هو ال first conditional يا شباب Uh, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm receiving lots of messages regarding the assignment. Okay. They, I don't know from where students they get. Uh, uh, يعني I explain everything in detail. And I explain everything in detail. So but then I find out. Sorry, يعني I am interrupting you. And you have to understand what I'm talking about regarding the assignment. Okay. They are asking if they have to answer on the same sheet. Uh, Shabab, you have to answer on the same sheet. You have to answer on the same sheet. Allah yarda alaykun hayden. Jawbu alayha wa abuha mazboot wa nazlu liyeha. Okay. Uh, my students, they, they submit to me. Dr. Shahanda students, they refer to her. Or Dr. Muhammad Abbas students, they refer to them. كل واحد بنزل عند الدكتور تبعه وبتحلو على نفس هيدا الورقة. بتحلو على نفس هيدا الورقة. Okay. فهمنا ولا لا يا جماعة الله يخليكم. ما عاش لنا نضل نسأل حرام عليكم صرنا حاكين ألف مرة بنفذ بالموضوع. Okay. حموت والله من هالأسئلة والله العظيم that's too much يعني كنا نفس الأسئلة صار بعيد بعيد نفس الأسئلة الله يخليكم اكتبوا نوت قولوا الدكتورة قالت هيك احكوا محالكم احكوا حالة قالت دكتور هيفا انه نحنا لازم نحل على نفس الورقة ونحط اسمنا واسم الدكتور ونحنا إذا بتعلمنا مس هيفا من نزل عن مس هيفا يمكن ما عش فيه يعني أنا آآ آآ يعني خلص ما عادش قادرة طيب هلا بدنا نروح شو كنت عم اقول يا جماعة ال conditional ال if ال conditional إذا كانت زيرو خلصنا منا we are going to start with the first conditional first conditional يا جماعة if plus the present simple plus will شو بيستخدم؟ بيستخدم will بيستخدم will يعني كيف؟ يعني if it rains I won't go to the park uh, يا أهلا وسهلا ألا ما عندي مشكلة والله بس مش نفس الأسئلة تنعاد أكتر من ألف مرة ألا إلي لي ألا مثلا بليز فهميني كذا كذا بفهمك ما عندي مشكلة من قلبي من قلبي بفهمك حبيبتي بس عيب يعني نضلنا نعيد ونحكي ونعيد ونحكي نفس الموضوع ما بيصير يعني مش صغار anyways if the conditional إذا نحن عنا if وعم نحكي عن شيء for example if present simple plus will plus infinity كيف يعني if, if it is used to talk about things which might happen in the future ممكن تصير بالفيوتشر كيف يعني if it rains كما I won't go to the park أنا شو بقول إذا شغلة ممكن تصير بالفيوتشر ممكن تصير if I study today I will go to the party tonight If I bring the vegetables to make the biryani, 
البرياني بيعملوها بالخضرة If I bring vegetables to make the biryani I, uh, uh, I will uh, cook the best biryani ever If, uh, if the teacher comes I uh, will uh, give her the homework سو so, شو يعني؟ هيدي الإف الشرطية المشروطة يعني إذا أنا بدي أستخدم مع آآ آآ شي ويل بلس جو مش بريزنت لاحظتوا هون ما عندي بريزنت عندي ويل بلس الفعل أمتى بستخدم الويل بلس فعل؟ إف أم توكينج أباوت سمثينج ذات مايت هابن إن ذا فيوتشر ممكن يصير بالفيوتشر ممكن يصير بالفيوتشر أوكي ممكن يصير بال future so if i study today i will go to the party tonight something that might happen in the future شو الفرق بين هيدي الفيرست واللي قبلها هيدي بستخدم verb in the present مع if وثاني part بيكون will مع verb فهمنا so اول شيء simple present okay rains and the other part won't يعني لا will not want اوكي okay. or will مع go will مع الverb يا جماعة أول واحد simple present وثاني واحد will مع ال present اوكي okay. فهمنا الرول يا جماعة فهمتوا الرول يلا اعملوا لي exercise صغيرة عليها هيدي الشرطية one minute and we have to خلينا نعملوا مع بعض صبايا تفاعلوا معي شباب صبايا تفاعلوا معي شوي بليز يلا If I go out tonight If I يا مروة go out tonight I go to the cinema اتفقنا إذا نحن عم نحكي عن شيء ممكن يصير بالفيوتشر شو بنقول أول فيرب بده يكون go وثاني فيرب بده يكون will مع go يا جماعة صح ولا لا؟ لأنه أنا I'm talking about something that ممكن يصير بال بالهيدا. شو بقول له لابني ما for example if you study hard إذا study hard I will take you to the park بالفيوتشر ممكن آخده ممكن لا حسب أوكي okay. so, so if you get back شو بده يصير if you get back I will بجد باي اي ويل بي انجري هيدي مشروطه الفعل هون اي ويل بي انجري مشروط بالاول واي ويل جو تو ذا سينما مشروط بالاول ذاتس واي بنقول لها كونديشنال مشروط اف وي دو نوت سي اف وي دو نوت سي يا صبايا ليش دو نوت سي يا مروه لانه بالبريزنت شو بيستخدم مع النوت دو داز اوكي وي ويل وي will see each other next week okay if he comes if he comes i will be surprised i will be surprised when you want to express an action that will happen in the future نستخدم present اول مع ال f with the f and a will مع ال verb الاصلي شو يعني الverb الاصلي see ما بحط seen ما بحط played بتكون will دايما بعد will و shall بستخدم الفعل البيز البيز يعني الأصلي دايما 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 من نستخدم مع after we use after will after shall after can the, 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 the verb in its original form in its base form ما بقول I will uh, jump I can't see that ما بقول I will seen no it's in, in its original form Can you understand, yeah, guys? Mm. Type. Hello, we are going to use the second conditional. Should we any second conditional? Lemma she, it is uh, probably not going to be true. أنا على طول كنت أقول لماما. For example, I tell my mom if I won the lottery. I will buy a big land. I would buy a big land in Lebanon. هلا أنا لما إلا if I won the lottery, إذا ربحت اللوتري, I would بقول. نحنا بنستخدمها غلط بنقول I will. هلا أنا غلطت وقلت I will. نحنا ما بنقول I will بنقول I would يا جماعة. 
if I met a queen of England, I would say hello. ليش بنستخدم would بالباس؟ لأنه لأنه الشيء إذا صار إذا صار ما هو ما صار ما هو منه present هو إذا صار this means إذا صار بالباس ممكن يعني بس هيدا الشيء يمكن يصير وما يصير افترضي انت ما التقيتي بكوين انجلاند يو ويل نوت سي هلو صح ولا لا يا جماعه؟ افترضي ربحتي انت ربحتي شيء ديد يو وين ذا لوتري؟ لا اف يو وون اف يو وون اف يو وون اي وود باي اف اف يو وود ترافل تو تركي اي وود سي باراك ذس اكزامبل مع الاعلام من الصبح اوكي تبع الاكل اوكي اف اي وود ترافل اي وود اوكي سوري اف اي ترافلد اي وود سي سو ليش بنعمل هيك لانه ات از ان ذا باست وما صارت وممكن تكون صحيحه بالفيوتشر وممكن لا اف اي وون ذا لوتري يعني اذا ربحت اللوتري اي وود باي ذا هاوس بالفيوتشر رح اشتري البيت اذا ربحت لا انا ما ربحت بعد اللوتري يو جيت ماي بوينت في شغله بدي اقول لكم اياها دائما مع اف اي بنقول وير اف اي وير يو ما بقول اف اي واز يو اوكي هاي قاعده رول هاي دي اتس ا رول اف اي وير يو شو بقول اف اي وير يو نوت اي اف اي واز يو سو ديد يو انديرستاند وات اي مين باي سمثينج ذات مايت بي نوت ترو ان ذا فيوتشر بستخدم الفيرب ان ذا باست الاول وود مع باي <تصفيق> would مع باي هلا بعدني قلتها would مع verb in the other part of the sentence did you get this guys did you get this if something might happen in the future ومش صحيح فهمتوني ولا لا might happen in the future ممكن يصير اوكي okay. based على شيء انت عم تتوقعينه كانه عم نحلم كانه we are dreaming كانه اذا إيه شفت زينب لح I will uh, I will give her uh, 500 BD I would give her 500 BD شو رأيك يا زينب تصيري غنية okay so what we are going to do now okay uh, I don't have 500 BD زينب right now <laughs> okay so what we are going to do now uh, uh, we are going to uh, continue an exercise about the second conditional ولو سمحتوا I want you to help me to do this exercise guys Please wake up and do. I don't want to explain alone. أنا بتملل إذا أنتم ما تعاونتوا معي صراحة. I want you to what to help me finish the lecture smoothly. حتى I want to enjoy what I'm doing. هلا we are going to uh, use here. Click on the link. Take two minutes, yeah, guy, to complete the exercise. The first five only. The first five لو سمحتوا. I will be choosing names. رح اختار أسماء يجاوبوا من الأتندس. نورة وشيمة. Zahra, Zainab, and Nada. You are going to uh, answer.
Okay, guys, yalla. Number one. Are you with me? Ready? Yalla. Zahra, Zahra, if I, what you, I uh, get a new job. نحن عم نحكي عن a second conditional is something that could not be true in the future. That will, يعني, ما, مم, would not be true in the future. ما بيكون صحيح. نحن بس عم نتهيأ له. Okay? شو منقول? What shall I say? If I, what you, I, a new job. يلا يا زهرة. If I were you, okay, I what? شو بنستخدم؟ I would get a new job. دايما دايما when you use past here, you have to use would plus the main verb here. Okay? Zainab, if he be, verb to be, if he what younger? Zainab, if he what younger? If he was younger, he what? He would travel. Excellent. He would, he would travel. Excellent. He would travel. Type. If we what finish? If we what finish? Bill past. Bill past. What do we use? Ma not. If we are not friends, sah? Well, if we were not friends. Bill past. If we were not friends, should be here. If we were not friends, I would be angry, right? I would be. I'm just following the rule. كيف بعرف إنه هاي ليك بدي استخدمها لأنه بتبين something that may not be true in the future. Okay, some something أنت عم تتخيلي لو نحنا ما كنا هيك لو أنا أخذت الهيك. Okay. So, if I have enough money, if I had money, لو كان عندي, يعني أنت ما عندك, لو كان عندك, I would buy, okay? So, مثل لما منحلم, okay? If she what be always, if she what, if she was not always so late, she would be promoted, she would be promoted, right or not right? Any question, guys? Okay, why I'm teaching you this? No, I want you, when you are bored, you have uh, nothing to do, refer to those links and to practice on your own. Tara, you can use them without feeling it, and you can use them in your life. You understand what I mean? Hey, this is how we learn. We practice, we practice, we absorb information. We, see, uh, we start to use this information in a right way without feeling that we are learning, guys. This is very important if you are willing to improve your English. Okay, any questions so far? Hala, I want you, we finish from this, I want you to uh, go for prepositions, guys. Do you want me to do prepositions or to review the essay because our time is running? You want to review the essays for or against essay, Walla, you want to do prepositions. I will upload this on Edmodo for you. شو بتحبو? What do you wish to do? Do you wish to do the essay, guys, or do you wish to do prepositions? Can you hear me? The essay, Allah. Yeah. Okay. نحنا when we want. Okay. خلاص يلا essay. Okay, uh, let's say, uh, uh, when we want to write for or against a say, this means we have to take a side. We are either against, we are, we are either for, and that's why we call it for or against a say. Sometimes we, uh, we are diplomatic. She and diplomatic. يعني منكون هيك دبلوماسي ينو منقول نحنا against for some reasons and we are for for other reasons. لأنه ممكن نكون عم نشوف إشي منيحة ومش منيحة ومنا نحكي عن اثنين. هلا in this paragraphs we are we are going to top tips for writing. Start by saying the current situation. In general introduction, then in introduction we start by talking generally in a general or generally about the topic. Then it's nice. Sometimes we start with a question. Some people they start with a story. Some people will start with a quote. 
كوت يعني مثل لحدا مشهور اوكي ذيس از وي كول ات ذا هوك ذا واي وي ستارت اور انتروداكشن ات اتراكتس ذا ريدر اوكي ات اتراكتس ذا ريدر فانتم حرين ذا واي تو ستارت بس اذا قال لك ريسيرش معناتها يو هاف تو ريسيرش تو جيت ذا انفورميشن اند رايت ات ان يور اون ويز ات ذا اند اوف ذا انتروداكشن وي هاف تو رايت ذا ثيسيس ستيتمنت والثيسيس ستيتمنت بتكون على الشكل التالي انه فور اكزامبل هلا بنشوف التوبيك وبنركب الثيس ستيتمنت. We write two paragraphs. Why you are with and why you are uh, against. Uh, why you are with يعني معناتها there are benefits and advantages. On the other hand, why you are against. When the conclusion to sum up or to conclude, you add your personal opinion. I personally believe that, in my opinion, I recommend that, I suggest that. كل هود ال feelings و suggestions بحطوهم بال concluding paragraph. Look at the introduction. Topic is the internet bad for young people? It is now easier than ever to access internet where you are using a computer, phone, tablet. There is no doubt that many young people are spending more and more time online with both positive and negative consequences. يعني يا جماعة الخير بثيس statement تبعه شو قال؟ قال إنه on spending young people when they spend time online بيرجع لهم بوزيتيف الى هيدا سلبياتها والى حسناتها، يعني in one paragraph he's going to talk about the positive consequences النتائج الايجابيه of using الاونلاين الانترنت او spending time uh, more time online والى negative consequences، يعني two body paragraphs، two body paragraphs، اوكي؟ two body paragraphs، one paragraph that talks about the positive and one consequences and the other paragraph talks about negative consequences. This is the thesis statement. And to show if you can tell you, I agree that internet is bad for young people for many reasons, but I also think that it has can it can have a neg a positive impacts on them. معناتها one paragraph تحكو عن positive impacts, one paragraph تحكو عن negative impacts. أو في كن تختو صيد واحد. You can tell us the internet. I agree that internet is bad for young people for many reasons. Okay. شوف ال ال paragraph الأولى ما أحليها وشوف ال topic sentence يا جماعة. كل body paragraph it has to start with a topic sentence. شوف ال topic sentence هون. One advantage of the internet is that young people can do research for their their school work and home work. هاي ال topic sentence هاي ال advantage uh, إنه young people بيستخدموها على their school work و their homework شو معنى هاي ال topic sentence إنه this paragraph will talk about إنه الإنترنت بنستخدمه لل school work وال homework it's highly important to start the body paragraph with the topic sentence تحددوا لي عن شو بكون تحكوا عن شو بكون تحكوا هون عن ال advantage أي advantage إنه ال people بيستخدموا الإنترنت ليعملوا school work و homework معناتها الباراجراف لازم تدور حول كيف الـ young people بيعملوا بيستخدموا الانترنت for school work and homework. Did you understand my point? Did you see how the topic sentence is important here? Yes or no, guys? You get my point? You see how did he mention يا زينب انه الـ young people can do research uh, for their school and work. معناتها الباراجراف اللي حتحكي عن هون نقطتين. This topic sentence is highly important, guys. Now, شوفوا الثاني واحدة. He is going to talk about the disadvantages or the negative consequences. شو قال? On the other hand, there are also negative consequences. But did he mention what are the negative consequences? ما قال. Right or not right? It's better to mention them. شو منقول? منقول on the other hand, uh, using an internet for a, a long time can cause what? Can cause health problems. زبط كون. And addiction or social uh, uh, anti uh, uh, or uh, or people who use the internet for a long time can become introspective in Azaliyin and can become can have eye eye muscle and eyesight problems eyesight sight problems okay so uh, what do I mean by that I mean that I'm going to talk about these two points in my paragraph. أنا ما حبيت ال topic sentence هون. Why? It's too short. It's good to mention there are also negative consequences like uh, uh, people can become addicted 
and they can become or people can become addicted and introspective when they use the online. And I like the topic sentence. Tحدد للنقطين اللي بدي أحكي عنهم. You get my point, ولا لا? You understand what I mean? When I I like that the topic sentence, uh, uh, it's it's highly, it, يعني it's a priority to mention in the topic sentence when, what you want to talk about. And I want to talk about the negative consequences, but hello to mention them. Hello to mention the negative consequences, yeah, Ella. Hello to say that the negative consequences are that it affects people. On the other hand, young people, when young people use internet for a long time, they become addicted and they become introspective, or they become antisocial. Meaning that you want to talk about how they become antisocial. They don't see the world, they don't know how to talk with the world, they don't know how to talk with the world. You want to talk about how they become addicted. 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 You get my point? So topic sentence is highly important. Topic sentence is uh, highly important. Now, if I want to go talk about the concluding sentence, concluding uh, paragraph, I have to mention uh, to sum up. I start always start with uh, some, to sum up or to conclude, guys. To sum up or to conclude. In this lesson, we have covered the what the uh, writing uh, for and against essay, and we mentioned uh, that uh, we start with our introduction, uh, two body paragraphs, it depends on the thesis statement and the concluding paragraph. Concluding paragraph, to sum up, it starts with what? To sum up. To sum up, spending time on the internet can have a negative impact, but it also it has advantages. حلو كتير نقول ال thesis statement بطريقة تانية. To sum up or to conclude, the uh, internet using internet for long, uh, using internet can have its a uh, good side and bad side. حلو تعملوا uh, referring. But شؤال لك شؤال. Personally, I think that internet is an incredible tool, and the benefits of internet uh, outweigh the dangers. حر عطا رأيه. قال it's an incredible tool وانه حسناتها اكثر من سيئاتها، انت حل حلوه انه تعطي رايك حره، حتى لو انا هذا الراي ما I don't agree with your opinion, but it's good to 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 say your opinion. I believe that using internet for doing homework and um, doing your work or certain tasks is really good. I don't agree that using internet for a long time uh, can co uh, can uh, can, uh, can uh, or using internet for a long time can have its uh, negative consequences like people become they may become addicted. You start start to explain how in it briefly. You understand what I mean? So you restate the thesis statement or advices in your conclusion. You understand what I mean guys? Do you have any questions? Sure. Is everything clear? Okay, do you have any questions before I, 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 uh, I uh, finish? Okay. طيب. خلاص يعني. I leave you now. حبيبتي مروة. Thank you يا عمري. يلا يعطيكم ألف عافية باي باي بعدنا عم يسألوا عن الديت عملت حالي مش سامعة أنا يا مريم إنك سألت عن الديت لا ولا يهمكم أهلا وسهلا فيكم ما عذبتوني هيدا واجبة هيدا واجبة هيدا واجبة إني أنا أعطي من قلب وفاهمكم وطول بالي عليكم وكون بيشنت ماشي فما تهكلوا الهم ما تهكلوا الهم يلا باي باي
حبيبتي يا لا انت الحل حلوه يا اموره يلا يا عمري باي حبيبتي